Observed every year on June 14th, the World Blood Donor Day is an initiative by the World Health Organization. The aim of this day is to, amongst others, spread awareness about blood donation and the need for safe blood and blood products. It is also to appreciate the contribution of voluntary blood donors in saving lives. At the Holy Family Hospital, which is the largest health facility in the Tichima municipality and a referral point in the Bunu East region and beyond, authorities are calling on individuals as well as organizations to come to their aid by supporting the facility's blood bank. Mr. Apia Anthony Mensa is the in charge of the Holy Family Hospital's laboratory. The hospital is strategically located, so it serves as a referral point for most of the facilities around the region. We receive a lot of referral cases from the northern region, from the upper west region, and even some part of Asante region. Because of the referrals that come to Holy Family Hospital, on the average, we transfuse about 10 pints of blood a day. So when you do the computation, you are getting close to about 300 pints of what? Blood. Being a month for blood transfusion. So we will encourage everybody to help so that we can save life. With blood shortage being a major problem, especially due to the number of accident cases recorded in the area, Mr. Apia Mensa says there is the need for the facility to have more blood in order to save lives. On the average, a month, we have about two or three accidents, mass accidents. But for the minor ones, almost every day, we get a lot of accidents. We do our possible best to get some of the blood for standby, to cater for emergencies. But there, like I did indicated, blood should always be readily available to save life. But there are times, if the numbers are so huge, and if exhausted our blood bank stock, then it becomes very difficult in managing most of the patients. For Gariba Marwan Abdraouf, who is the blood donation organizer for the Holy Family Hospital, though there's been an improvement in the number of voluntary blood donors in the area, the situation is sometimes rare, especially during rainy seasons and in the month of Ramadan. During rainy seasons, we have a lot of case. You know, as Holy Family, we are serving as the referral center now. So a lot of cases from the rural areas are coming here. So before they will come here, maybe they are short of blood, we need blood. So, and we have like cases like anemia in pregnancy, uh, PPH, with spatum hemorrhage. So, adore readiness is in, in the fasting period because some of them have ulcer and they are not allowed to fast and they want to, they want to fast. So, we have a lot of challenge. And most of the time, so the replacement is a problem because when someone is fasting, the person cannot come and replace. If the relative is giving blood, there's no way a, 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 a relative can, will come and replace the blood. So we have a problem during fasting seasons. Garba Abdurraouf asks that more education needs to be carried out in order to encourage people into donating blood voluntarily. For now, a lot of people are coming in day in, day out to come and donate blood. Every day we have voluntary donors. So that, that is what I'm saying. You have to educate them. The benefit they'll get, you should understand, so that each and everyone will understand why there is the need to donate blood. We met a number of blood donors at the facility. Cletus Abeka is one of them. He says contrary to misconceptions about the risk associated with blood donation, he feels okay each time he donates blood. First time me by you first, or maybe me yet moja meet me yajma. Now me yeah at the age me come up from Kwaya me jumaba. First time the me sudo. It is me ye fair time, it's not a second time. My own say, Pulubl and Vienna. Inti, why won't ye da, oh no, but I say, yes, no, that's where you have the air. He therefore calls on all to inculcate the habit of donating blood in order to save lives. My country and the Pase, the Casabe, Yimoja, and yes, we are very oyare, and now, and yes, sir, it is over here, over ye in a mass room, we as we mark the World Blood Donor Day today under the slogan, Give Blood and Keep the World Beating, 
Mr. Pia Mensa called on all to contribute in the donation of blood voluntarily to help support victims and save lives. Blood donation is uh, one of the precious gifts one can give to his or her brother. Because when you give blood, it's like we're giving life. We're saving life. And no amount of money can buy what? Life. So as today, mass, with the word blood donation, day, we will encourage everybody to help in donating at least a unit of blood so that we can save a brother's life. The facility, as part of its measures of having enough blood as its blood bank, is today holding a blood donation exercise at the St. Francis Senior High School in Boyam. Reporting for Joy News, Anas Sabit, Tichiman.